Hi, I'm Chris Hill, founder of FuneralResources.com, and this video we're going to talk about memorial reefs. And this is a really, really neat way to look at options for cremation because traditionally uh, a cremation is used uh, as an urn or maybe an ash scattering. And because of all these new and innovative funeral technologies, one of the most uh, advanced for the cremation arena is a memorial reef. Why? Because what a memorial reef is, is it is a underwater living legacy. And it's a really neat way that they do it. Usually, they all have a consistent theme in that they allow the family to participate in creating the reef and personalizing it in putting things on the reef and, and handprints or medallions. It's a very popular choice for the military because of somebody in the Navy, let's say. Families say they're in a place where they belong, where it's fitting, where they would choose to be. And a lot of people choose this in advance, which is a good thing to do is pre-plan this if this is a good option for you. But these memorial reefs are put into a boat. The family goes out, they have a ceremony, they're put into a place where you can always go back, you can scuba dive. Sometimes they even do the ceremony underwater. The family actually go underwater and have the ceremony at the reef. And they're green, meaning they're environmentally friendly reefs. And what I like, I've heard a term life creating life, and that's exactly what they do. They, they take a life, put it in a place where the families feel it should be, you get to choose the place, and oftentimes it's a place where you generally used to vacation and share with a loved one. So you can go and have that same family vacation, uh, share in the memories with the family, remember them in a place where you always used to, and then have them be an underwater legacy in that area so every time you go back you get to visit. And one last thing which I think is really important to think about is there's a lot of people who never got to know where somebody wanted their final resting place and they're sitting in urns somewhere that they may or may not feel that's the right place for them. Um, and this gives an excellent option to taking a loved one who may have loved the water or may be a great fit for this and put them into a memorial reef and allow you to feel better that they're in a final resting place that they belong and it brings you great joy to know that you have a place you can visit them where they should be. So this helps you learn a lot about memorial reefs and it will help you see if this is a good fit for you and your family and your loved ones and help you make a difficult situation a little bit easier.